Let's carry on by creating a prepayment invoice. It's very important to pay attention. As soon as I click on this, the recommended value is going to say, usually you should only pay for the product receipts that you have received, which makes sense, but not in the case of prepayment. You have to select no. For prepayment, you select no. And as you see, as soon as I say no, it's just going to bring the value of the prepayment, not the total amount. And I specify a particular invoice number, which is again due to the localization. Some of these values must be numerical. Some of them may be alphanumerical. It really depends on localization, which I'm not going to get into the details of it. And then I do the posting because automatically this is already passed anyways, because you're not matching it to anything but the prepayment category. It's a category. I click post. As you see, it says is not confirmed. That's one of the other cosmetic glitches. If you recall, I changed a few things here and there. I added a brand new prepayment, but I did not confirm the purchase order. But unfortunately, the invoice button was enabled and you have a pending vendor invoices. But receive works properly because it's faded. 